So I don't know if I'm going to regret this or if I actually made a good decision. Today we're going to be opening up an older box of Sword and Shield booster packs and we're going to see what we're going to be able to pull from Brilliant Stars, Fusion Strike, and some other ones. But before we get into that opening, I want to let you know real quick, we are going to be giving away a set of Pokemon cards from my own collection. All you have to do to enter this free giveaway is simply like this video, drop a comment down below, and make sure you're subscribed. All right, so today I went to my local comic book shop. Uh, it's a comic book shop and a card store, and I figured I would just go ahead and see what I might be able to pick up in the way of any kind of older packs and stuff like that. They had a lot of the newer stuff, Scarlet and Violet, and you know obviously the 151 and some of the newer packs as well uh, but this particular box caught my eye because it was a box that featured sword and shield which i have not opened up in a long time and it was only 20 dollars for seven booster packs plus this apparently has a lot more stuff i'm not really kind of holding out my hopes for something crazy in this but it does have three promo cards which don't even look hollow at all to begin with. And as you see here, it has seven booster packs, uh, three of the cards there, uh, a cool Pokemon coin, four sticker sheets, a Pokemon notebook, so we'll have to see what that's like, and of course our code card. But yeah, let's uh, get right into this. All right, now that we have our outer layer opened up, let's take a look at what is inside this box. I have honestly never seen this box before. Some of you might be familiar with it, but uh, I am personally not. Okay, so opening it right up, we have our three promo, promo cards, and I was wrong. We actually do uh, get some nice hollows. So look at that Cyndaquil right there. He's looking cute as can be. Man, I love you, buddy. Cyndaquil is an awesome starter. And um, so we are actually not getting the three Hoenn starters. We are actually getting a mix of different starters. So we have Rowlet from the Alola region right there. Looking cool, looking good. And we have our little Oshawott. Looking nice and cute. And actually, I'm really excited. I, uh, I do think that this is actually a cool coin. I mean, look at that Arceus right there. I was actually gonna be a little bit bummed if we weren't gonna get anything that has anything to do with Arceus, given that he's actually in the you know on the face of the box but yeah it's nice that uh we actually do get some arceus there all right so let's take a look at what we have here so we got some more cardboard we gotta go through and we have our booster packs right here vivid voltage vivid voltage vivid voltage okay so we got some brilliant stars we got two brilliant stars our code card right there uh, we got our Fusion Strike and one Evolving Skies. All right, so this is uh, shaping out to be pretty good on uh, on these uh, on these packs here. All right, let's get back into the box and let's see what else we have. So let's get this bit of cardboard out. So we have a sticker set right there, it looks like. So we have the three starters for the promos. Okay, and we have a couple of sheets. So we have Cyndaquil, we got Arceus right there, or Arceus. All right, got another sheet there. We got a Rowlet and an Oshawott. And then we have a notebook with actually some nice little pattern there. And nice little blank notebook. So yeah, that's actually pretty cool. All right, but now the real reason why we're here is to get into some of these packs. So uh, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save the Brilliant Stars and the Evolving Skies for last and Fusion Strike on top of that. And then we're gonna go into the three Vivid Voltage. So let's just do it. Let's get right into it. All right, so it has been a hot minute since I've opened anything Sword and Shield. So we're gonna have to see what we can pull in these. Uh, I honestly don't even know what are some of the bigger things that I can pull. So let's take a look at our code card right there. And we're gonna go uh, one, two, three, four to the front. All right, now let's see what we can go with. All right, so we got our Fire Stunfisk, Hitmontop, Mag Cargo, got our Talo, our another Oshawott right there, a Sandile, Pineco, Clefairy. Ooh, a nice reverse hollow right here. And what do we have? A non-hollow Donphan. All right. 
All right, on to our next pack of Vivid Voltage. Yeah, like I said, it has been a hot minute since uh, <laughs> we got another Talo. Nice. Um, it has been a hot minute since I've opened anything up Sword and Shield, so. All right. All right, so we got one, two, three, four to the front. And we have our Energy, Moo Moo Cheese, Sableye, Galvantula, Talo again, Oshawott again. Sandile again, Pineco again, Clefairy again. All right, Heroes Metal Reverse Hollow and oh, nice, a Darmanitan V Max, very nice. All right, I will take that. That is, that is a good one. All right, yeah, Galarian Darmanitan is honestly not my favorite, but uh, I will take a V Max. That is for sure. All right, moving on to the next set. All right. We've got our C dot right here, but let's go and take a look at our code card. And we're gonna go one, two, three, four. All right. And we got our energy. Ooh, Charmeleon. Telescopic Sight, Mightyena, C dot, Picky Peck, Mudbray, Joltik. Very nice to go with our Galvantula we got earlier. Uh, we got a Weedle, and we got a Reverse Hollow Swoobat. And a Hollow Shaman, very nice. I will take that. That is, that's honestly very nice. All right, moving on to our next single pack of Fusion Strike. So needless to say, in the Sword and Shield era, I'm definitely looking for some of the um, Galarian uh, illustration, the Galarian gallery. Two, three, four. And uh, yeah, just looking for some VMAXs. Was, uh, that's always a good hit. All right, so we got our energy, got a Shauna, Victini, Electric, Dosslefur, Mudkip, Sandshrew, Cufant, into a Impidim, a Reverse Hollow Baltoy, and oh, oh, hey, Hollow Energy! Look at that. That's honestly very, very nice. That is beautiful. Look at that. Gold Energy. Oh, that is gorgeous. Honestly, that. Yeah, that's incredible. I mean, even look at the uh, at some of the, uh, the the surrounding, you know, silver right around there. That's honestly really, really nice. Yeah, that's honestly something I'm pretty uh, <laughs> pretty excited about right there. All right, so we do have two packs of Brilliant Stars. I'm gonna save that Arceus for last. So let's go into this Whimsicott pack right here. All right, there we go. Finally got it open, and. We do have a cast form right there, but let's go take a look at the code card. We have a one, two, three, four. Okay. And all right, so we got our energy. Sharon's Care, Pachirisu, Kindler, Cast Form, Chimchar, Baltoy, Axew, Nose Pass. All right, so we got a reverse hollow cleansing gloves and into a Flygon non hollow. All right, moving on to our next pack of Brilliant Stars, the Arceus pack. So could this be a god pack? I mean, it literally has Arceus on the front. <laughs> I mean, can you imagine? Can you imagine a god pack with an Arceus on the front? That would be that'd be pretty insane. All right, so we got our code card. Bada boom, bada bing. We're gonna go one, two, three, four. All right, so we got our energy. Executor, Choice Belt, Staravia, Cast Form, ooh, Chimchar, Baltoy, Axew, got a Nose Pass. Oh, beautiful Flareon right there. Oh, and following up with the Mimikyu VMAX. Look at that, a double hit. Wow, look at that. All right, these, whew, man, all right, we redeemed ourselves. We didn't really get too crazy of pulls so far, but we got two beautiful pulls in one pack. I, I'll take it. I mean, not quite a god pack, but hey, I will take it. That is absolutely beautiful. I knew Arceus would, would really pull it in for us. I mean, come on, look at those right there. Absolutely beautiful. All right, so we got our last pack here, the Evolving Skies, and we're gonna see if we can get some last pack magic and see if we can get another pull. I mean, we got some great pulls today so far on this random $20 mystery box. Not really even a mystery box, but... Uh, but just an older box of Sword and Shield that was clearly on clearance because there was like five of them uh, just chilling in this one little case. OK, 
Okay, all right, so we got our Evolving Skies open, and we got our code card, uh, and we're gonna go, yeah, one, two, three, four to the front, and we got our Energy, got our Shell Gone, Full Face Guard, Hypno, hey, how you doing, buddy? Tentacool, Pumpkaboo, my wife would love that, Bagon, Love Disc, Got our C dot. Okay, reverse hollow Ludi Colo. That's looking pretty nice. I honestly like the reverse hollows on the Sword and Shield era versus the Scarlet and Violet. There's something about the sword, the uh, with the yellow borders as well. Just yeah, just really nice to see. All right, and what is going to be our last rare? Our last rare for the video. All right, we're gonna do it. Three, two, one. Oh. But anyways, guys, that about does it. I would say that this $20 box was honestly worth it, and I'm honestly really glad that I picked it up. I mean, that Flareon and the Mimikyu VMAX are just personally two great pulls of mine that I'm really excited about. Now, if you want to watch any of my other Pokemon content, definitely check out this video right here or check out this video. Make sure you subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.